All right, this is Big Dogs Porting over here. Today we have another Victor EFI for um, the lower is uh, 3886. So this is going on the application, um, 351 base application. The combo is 445 cubic inch. Uh, 4.155 bore, 4.10 stroke. Um, this customer wants the runners to pull up to 6,700 RPM on that application. He's looking for a 90 millimeter throttle body tunnel, um, 1,150 CFM worth of throttle body flow, and the minimum 360 per runner, both together. So we're gonna see what this manifold starts off with. Um, those are some big numbers that um, are expected from this manifold, but this is Big Dog's port, and so you know we do everything big here. We get big numbers, big horsepower. Uh, we make parts flow and produce horsepower that they normally wouldn't do. Um, so we're gonna go ahead, do a before flow on we have it set up for the number one runner and then we're going to flow the number four runners both together everything blocked off like usual for the skeptics got that plug in there this is done up make sure that's good that's done up so we're going to go ahead pause it turn the flow bench processor on and get it started so we have the processor set up, get ready to flow the number one runner. So we're looking at 269 CFM, 268, 269 CFM from the number one. This is bone stock. Only thing we did was sandblast it, clean it, inside and out to make sure we don't get any gook or grime in our flow bench um, we're going to go ahead set it up for the number four runner right there number four and we're going to flow that one so the number one right now is sitting at 268 269. so we have it set up at the number four runner on this victor efi and we're going to go ahead and flow it to see what this bad boy does. Two hundred seventy one, two hundred six, two hundred seventy, seventy one. Ah, it says two hundred and seventy. Two seventy, two seventy one on the number one. On the number, number four. I'm sorry, number four. So there you go, right there. Now. This is a good example of what we do. You know, uh, we're looking out there and we're wondering why a lot of porters, you know, a lot of companies that do porting and sell parts, we're wondering why they don't provide you guys with the before and after flow test. And that's a question that smart individuals will ask. Why don't these big name or these well known porters provide that they'll either provide a afterflow but you really don't know where your part came from you don't know if the part gains from their flow from their porting you don't know if it gained 30 cfm 13 cfm or 3 cfm and then when they do provide data they never provide any real proof. No videos, no pictures. It's just printed data. So basically, they want you to trust them. We're in an industry where a lot of companies are taking advantage of customers that don't have the ability to test and check behind these companies. So these companies tend to just tell these guys anything. They say, hey, it's ported. And they make the ports look pretty. 
but a pretty looking port doesn't mean it's going to flow well or does it mean it's going to flow as much as it could flow see we're all about making horsepower we're not about catering to the industry we cater to our customers we want our customers combos to kick ass plain and simple we don't want our customer combos to be just good enough if you guys have talked to to me tony or anybody at you know big dogs via message you know we're very eager to get your combo up and going and to produce the kind of power that you want just good enough is not good enough for us if that's all you want go to somebody else we're not going to do just good enough and our prices are some of the lowest in the industry so that's not our argument there we've often heard customers say well you know i would have paid a lot more uh if you asked because what i got was great and you know we understand that but we also understand that in this industry in hot rodding things can get pretty pricey and our goal is to set up our customers to where they can enjoy their vehicles you know as far too many guys have their cars sitting on jack stands or their projects taking four five six years and they never get a chance to really enjoy their vehicle we're not about that you know even if you have stock heads a stock intake manifold we'll work with you to port your products your port your parts to where you can go out there and have some fun you know not everybody needs you know three thousand dollar cylinder heads or a thousand dollar intake manifold you know just think about where you guys started off from you started off with stock cars doing little modifications and going out there having fun competing against your guys your buddies and just having fun and we want to keep it like that but we want to take it on the next level we want the parts whether it's factory or aftermarket to perform a lot better the industry standard and what people are accustomed to you know we get gt40 manifolds to perform better than aftermarkets and we get aftermarkets to perform better than pretty much anything out there that anybody else can produce so we're going to come back after we perform the um port work on this manifold we're going to flow it again and i'm 150 percent sure we're going to meet and exceed the customer's goals and expectations see you guys at the track